YouTube, how's everyone doing? One shot bringing you guys another Modern Warfare 2 video. And for today's upload, I wanted to go over my top three concerns for Modern Warfare 2 multiplayer heading into launch. For those of you unaware, we are about three weeks away from the early access campaign event and about four weeks away from the full release of the game. I'm really excited for the launch of this game. I had a lot of fun playing the beta. It was probably my most enjoyable Call of Duty beta experience that I've played so far. So that's exciting. But obviously there still are some things that I would like to see change, which I'm gonna go over in today's video. If you guys are new to the channel, Channel, please be sure to hit that subscribe button. I go over everything Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 related. I have a bunch of content planned for the next few weeks heading up into the launch of the game and then obviously a bunch of content once Modern Warfare 2 launches so you won't want to miss that but let's go ahead and jump into today's video. So after playing the weekend 2 beta of Modern Warfare 2 my number one concern for multiplayer at the moment is definitely footstep audio. This was something that I did not mention in my weekend 1 beta feedback video because I honestly didn't really notice it to be that much of a problem but after playing in weekend 2 I noticed that footstep audio is definitely going to need some work around both for your enemy footsteps and for your teammate footsteps it just seems that they're too loud you can hear enemies coming from halfway across the map around corners through walls and when you watch your kill cams you can tell when people are listening for your footsteps obviously with no pings on the mini map when you fire a weapon this has kind of shifted the way everyone gets information as to where the enemy is coming from now they're gonna be listening for more footsteps since they can't use the mini map as much and with loud footsteps and a balancing issue this is definitely a problem infinity war did mention in their blog post after weekend two that they were looking into footstep audio some more and they're going to make some changes for launch i just hope that they make significant changes and that the footstep audio doesn't remain too loud because in the current state that it's in it's definitely way too loud my second biggest concern with modern warfare 2 multiplayer at the moment is definitely visibility and this concerns visibility across the board first when firing your weapon there still seems to be a little bit too much smoke and flare coming from your weapon when you're firing can definitely make for tracking enemies to be super difficult and hard. They did make an adjustment to this from weekend one to weekend two. However, I would like to see a little bit more of a tuning here just to make sure that we are easily able to track our enemies because this will lead me into the second part of visibility, which is nameplates. Nameplates are no longer on your screen for the enemy in Call of Duty, which is something that, again, I'm not sure why they're taking these core Call of Duty features out of the game. They said that they're looking for a change in visibility regarding tracking enemies that's not traditional to the nameplate so I'm curious to see as to what this is gonna be but I'm glad that they're at least listening to community feedback because visibility and tracking enemies is something that has definitely been a big issue in the beta and then my third kind of part two visibility is the kill streaks when kill streaks come down grenades any explosive there just seems to be way too much smoke that lingers on the map smoke that just seems to be seeping through the walls and not having any really rhyme or reason to it and creating large parts of the maps that are pretty much unplayable because you can't even see anything. And some of these smoke effects were lasting like 20, 30 seconds, which is definitely way too long. So I would like to see them make some changes around here before the launch of the game. And last but not least, my third biggest concern with Modern Warfare 2's multiplayer is definitely the no ping on the mini map when you fire your weapon. This was something that I mentioned in my weekend one feedback video, but something that I feel needs to be mentioned again. This is a core Call of Duty feature that does not need to be removed. And it seems as though all of the community is pretty much in support of keeping the ping on the minimap so I'm not sure why they're removing this seems as though this is a move to protect the casuals when I would argue that casuals maybe even use the radar even more for weapon firing because they don't know where the enemy is coming from I think this is a losing battle though I doubt this is gonna come back into the game but I just had to mention it because this is something that I feel does not need to be removed but that's all I have for you guys today just wanted to share my top three concerns with Modern Warfare 2's multiplayer heading into launch like I said I'm really enjoying this game just a couple concerns that I have wanted to share those with you guys let me know what your guys's thoughts are what are you most concerned about with the game right now but i think we have a lot to be looking forward to and a lot to be excited about thank you guys so much for watching and i look forward to seeing you in the next video